WXII 12. This is WXII 12 News at noon. Hi everyone, I'm Aixa Diaz in for Margaret Johnson. New information this afternoon in the case involving WXI 12 News morning anchor Tolly Carr. Carr is charged with DWI in an accident that killed a Winston-Salem man. Angela Pellerano is live in the newsroom with today's big story. Angela. Aixa, Tolly Carr was scheduled to appear in court today for his first court appearance, but that case was continued until May 9th because the investigation is not over. Carr did not show up in court, but his attorneys were there to represent him. He's having very strong family support you know, from his, he has a very small, close family, but they are supporting him very closely. And he's gotten a lot of contact from friends uh, as well. Meanwhile, we've learned that the SBI has sent Carr's blood alcohol test results to police. But prosecutors say they won't release the results until the investigation is complete. On the morning of March 11th, Carr was charged with DWI after police say he drove through a construction zone, ran off the road, and hit 26-year-old Casey Bachhoven. Investigators say Carr declined to take a breathalyzer test at the scene. That's why they got a warrant to take samples of his blood to determine what his blood alcohol content was at the time of the wreck. And again, those blood alcohol test results are in, but it will not be released until the investigation is complete. Carr's co next court appearance, excuse me, is scheduled for May 9th. Ike, so let's send it back to you. All right, thanks a lot, Angela. This is a story we're continuing to follow. To learn more about the case and to watch previous stories, go to WXI12.com.